Hello guys, this is XX Lego Teen XX, and today I have another um, kind of minifigure pack, but this time we're doing the Lego minifigures series, series 11. And uh, I'm more kind of trying to do the Lego movie, but uh, I just picked these up at Target as well while I did the Lego movie sets too. So, uh, this is kind of a little bit of a break before we uh, do the rest of the Lego movie people. And uh, if this is popular, I'll uh, do a whole nother series on this too. So, anyways, let's get into the uh, first minifigure pack and uh, let's see what we have. So, yeah, there we go. And uh, let's pour it out. And it uh, seems to be that we have uh, one of these, just like we had for the Lego movie, only with these minifigures. So, so um, yeah, this is the um, kind of all the minifigures you can get, um, like a warrior dude, a uh, kind of scarecrow dude, looks like a um, pretzel lady or someone from like Sweden, Netherlands area kind of thing. Really cool space dude, which uh, kind of reminds me of, for those of you who played Halo, kind of reminds me of a Spartan. But uh, yeah, next you have this kind of island tribal kind of dude or with this like tiki head. Um, a gingerbread man with a uh, cup that says drunk me. So, that's funny. That's kind of cool. Next, we have um, an elf with a teddy bear and a um, a present. A, uh, a yeti with an ice cream or something. Or just regular ice. I don't know. A, rockin', a rock climber um, with a pickaxe and kind of rope. A welder with a welder, obviously, and a welding mask. He looks pretty cool. A uh, scientist with two beakers, a um, uh, kind of blues guy with a saxophone, really sweet hat, um, a diner person with roller skates, and um, a tray with like kind of a milkshake. Another cat lady because uh, that that's funny because the Lego Movie uh, they have a cat lady that you can get so. Two cat ladies in two different lines. A uh, an English uh, policeman, kind of retro, but that looks cool. And a, uh, a kind of robot housemaid kind of a thing. So, anyways, uh, basically what what kind of happened? I uh, cut and then I tried to make a uh, another video or like kind of to finish it off, but I learned that uh, that didn't work so I had to re kind of redo it so I've already cut the bags open and yeah so anyways the first mini minifigure that we have um, there's the stand for it but we have the Yeti which is cool um, yeah it's kinda got some hair which is cool and uh, blue hands no back printing and some belt printing there and uh, foot printing and stuff. So, yeah, he's kind of got that little belly button there. Anyways, you have uh, the Yeti head. So I'll put that on. And there you go. That is the Yeti. It has nice blue, or actually kind of yellowish teeth and a blue face. The eyes kind of looks like thick eyebrows right there. And, um, yeah. So let's just uh, put him on his stand. So... Excited for that figure. And uh, the next one that we have is uh, the Spartan. Again, I'm sorry that I couldn't open these, but it's just I kind of had a glitch kind of a thing. So we have kind of this warrior kind of dude. And uh, yeah, he comes with uh, two swords. But, um, yeah, so let me just build him really quickly. Um, 
Now he has some really cool leg printing and uh, arm printing, which I'll show you. But Lego just did a great job on this minifigure and the uh, the hair here. It's the same hair that uh, Boba Fett has in the 2013 Lego uh, Lego Star Wars Advent Calendar. For those of you who have that set, it's the same hair. But yeah. So, here's the uh, kind of warrior dude. He's got a nice big bronze belt. A uh, few uh, few scars right there and on his face too. He's got kind of a s almost sash thing. But I, I don't actually know what it's called. That thing. And, uh, another belt, more belt printing. Um, so the leg printing, what I wanted to show here is uh there's like he's got his whole loincloth thing going on there oh and uh on the torso they have uh, arm printing so it's a gauntlet on this side kind of bronze and then on this side it's just like uh like animal hide wrapped around his wrist to kind of protect it uh anyways he um what's really cool about the leg printing he's got the boots with the fur and stuff that's great but it's like, it has side leg printing, which LEGO has never done, to my knowledge. You can correct me if I'm wrong there, but this is insane to me. This is really, really cool that they would do side leg printing. So LEGO went all out props to LEGO. Really good job. And yeah. So he also gets his LEGO stand kind of a thing. So, um that's all I have. Again, I'm going to make more episodes of these if it becomes popular, but my primary is the Lego movie line, so this has just kind of been a little break before we go on to the other Lego movie stuff. So, thanks for watching. Please have a great day, and uh, check out my channel. So, see ya. <laughs>